so welcome everybody um, I thought it might be a good idea to make a little review about the Polo Digital it's like an incubator startup hub right here in uh, Malaga city and as we're exhibiting here and it's a nice place uh, for startups maybe to come and to consider to just uh, come here to, to, to settle your company here I wanted to show you this place a little bit around and uh, tell you a little bit about Malaga and um, the Polo Digital so the Polo Digital you can see here right behind me it's for startups uh, incubating uh, well yeah center where you can you can rent offices you can take part in accelerator programs and the city is doing very much for the startup economy here uh, trying to provide them with uh, industrial connections to the, to the right companies you can see there on the on the banner right there there are names like samsung sony is here um, ericsson nokia um, and a bunch of other important companies here from the area and um, yeah well so they are doing a great job to get in touch everybody with each other so have young talents here giving them a home uh, for the for the first stage companies um, and meet um, other people so today there's an event uh, in the in the Polo Digital where you have uh, we can exhibit your virtual reality solutions it's all about virtual reality today and there are around about 200 people 300 people going coming by and taking a look at your at your um, exhibition and what you what you at your products yeah and well this Polo Digital is here right in front of the automotive museum right here behind me it's a pretty really pretty place it's a really nice uh, you know environment to, to stay at and for example it's a very creative atmosphere so um, well we just gone well let's go let's go into inside and take a look and um, see how it's like yeah hope you guys enjoy it so inside of the Polo Digital you can find the, some showrooms where you can uh, take a look at the different technologies um, you have for example some Microsoft HoloLens here if you want to test out this technology you can have a look Basically, this room is a permanent installation in this building, so you can take a look at all the technologies that are around and some some fancy other stuff from, uh, I don't know, I would say a different era, but it's still augmented reality and uh, still very interesting. So, um, yeah, so you can see there's the different stuff they are showing and down here in the, in the, in the atrium of the building there are speeches Right now there's a speech of the organizers and you can see down there, the, wait, where's my finger? This is the mayor and he's the guy, he's an uh, amazing guy uh, who just uh, keeps track of this all yeah, and uh, keeps bringing startups and innovation to Malaga, which is great I guess so. And here you can see people testing out the Vive, PlayStation VR, Oculus, like there's everything around. Well, and they have fancy stuff here around. They have arcade machines all over the place. So basically, this is kind of, I don't know what it's usually, a cafeteria, mensa, open space, meeting place. Well, it, it, it looks fancy as well. It has like uh, the signs like in Fallout 4. So there was a lot of thought spent to it. And what I like really much is that they have this uh, survival league arena here where you have in a other place, in the atrium, you can just play video games. So Malaga has a very, um, let's say, a, a, a good scene for, for game events. So there's the, um, an event called, um, what's it called? I get the name, wait right now I have the name it's game police and it's an exhibition it's pretty big here in Spain it's like the Gamescon uh, or the E3 but in Spanish and here actually in Malaga as well and so the people doing this are located here in Malaga as well and you can find pretty much gaming uh, activities around here in, in fact so here you can play Rocket League or you can play League of Legends or different games here in this area and get some 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 nerd food if you like so this is uh, pretty nice because uh, being a game startup like us Jimcraft 
making video games means playing video games as well. Yeah? So over here in this corridor, here so in, in these rooms they allocated a little bit the different booths of the companies. So for example, in this booth we can find uh, Sony VR. So if you want to try Sony VR with the um, for this gun air or stuff and yeah with the move controller you can all the, the gadgets and the equipment you can try it out it's pretty fun I will come back later because I want to try this definitely it looks looks pretty cool so going down the corridor there are different guys doing different stuff these guys are doing um, multiplayer table tennis as a demo and they do, uh, develop um, applications for businesses. And in this booth where we are located ourselves with Gymcraft, with the amazing Gymcraft fitness equipment, interactive fitness equipment, um, there is uh, the Costa del Sol Tourism and from uh, the Punta de Andalucía. They are, everybody's digitalized by now, everybody has VR. So, um, it's uh, pretty amazing. So, yeah, all, all over the place. You have the colleagues of Opossum Studios. They are doing cultural VR demos. It's very nice. Um, so, for museums and uh, stuff like this. And here you have virtual reality. It's empty. And over here, it's a very interesting one. They do uh, 360 degree video streaming and um, in a decent quality, which is not very often in, in 360 video for VR. So they are doing a great job. So if you are interested in this, take a look at their website. And over here is a very interesting place. This is like a co-working office, a co-working space where the different people work actually. And I sneak in here. You can see people just right now working. Meanwhile, the exhibition, they are working on projects. It's pretty nice. And overhead, the different studios. So, talking about the uh, Polo Digital, it's a, it's a very nice place. Yeah, you can see it's, they, they made it really fancy. You have like cool pixel art on the wall. You have your Fallout for uh, Mensa and different spaces where you can do cool events and upstairs they have uh, on the floor upstairs the, the the people have their offices so they are quite cheap and partially um, assisted by the by the city and yeah I, I can really recommend it if you have a young startup a technology startup even uh, this is a place yeah so Spain offers a lot of uh, let's say um, innovative um, uh, programs that support companies and startups and um, yeah and it has a really nice weather down here you have the beach and you have work at the same place that's pretty awesome I can just recommend it so I'll drop a link in the description for for the Polo Digital and maybe to the some other stuff you can see the video I just try to collect all the links maybe someone's interested and uh, have fun and drop me a line if you want to know something about uh, running a startup in Spain. I will be happy to give you some information on that. Bye.